With no professional hockey team in D Danville this season, fans are asking the city to bring back an old favorite. A few dozen of them filled the Palmer Arena boardroom tonight, showing their support for the Dashers. WCIA 3 Scarlett O'Hara was there. Scarlett, how'd it go? We saw a lot of orange tonight on jerseys, posters, and t-shirts that said, bring back the Dashers. Board members listened, and the team's former owner says he could be ready to make a deal. It's not just that we want them back, Danville needs them back. Hockey fans are eager to return to the stands, but not without the Danville Dashers on the ice. The Dashers, it was a family team. Other organizations didn't have that, but we're hoping to bring that back. You take family out of it, out of any sport, you don't have anything. Former Dashers owner Barry Soskin says the Dashers played for about a decade with a good record eventually winning a championship title. But two years ago, they were replaced by the Bobcats. I felt bad for the fans. The fans that took me 10, 11 years to build up. The Bobcats recently ceased operations after failing to appear for a home game. So Dashers fans took the opportunity to ask Palmer Arena board members to bring back their team. You can feel the love and support. Jenna Worth is the president of the Danville chapter of Ambux, an organization helping people with disabilities. She says the Dashers always supported them. Just an avenue that we can share those experiences with everybody. Nobody was excluded. We didn't get that with the prior team. Before public comments started, board chairman Dean Shore addressed the crowd, saying he's excited to bring hockey back to Vermilion County. We're looking forward to one, meeting with the Dashers and sending out requests for proposal. And Soskin says he's willing to return if the right deal is struck. What is that right deal? Let's sit down at the negotiating table and talk about it. The board chairman says they'll be making sure any team interested in playing for Danville will be properly vetted and the future lease agreement is airtight. Back to you.